Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to migrate Windows 8.1 to an SSD drive using Paragon Hard Disk Manager. Now, before I start, I need to make sure that my SSD drive is properly installed. So I'll go to Disk Management by right-clicking this PC, Manage, Disk Management. Now, here I have both hard drives. Disk 0, which is my main drive, drive C which I want to migrate to my disk 1 which is my SSD drive now I'm gonna go ahead and right click properties just so you won't feel cheated that this is not an SSD drive notice here is an SSD 64 gig perfect now again notice that the size of my main drive is 160 gig and my SSD is 64 now that really doesn't matter what matters is the space used on that drive so if I right click my main drive properties notice that my used space is about 14.1 gig so my SSD drive which is 64 is good enough so I'll close here and run Paragon Hard Disk Manager 14 Suite the link is in my website in the description box below. This is a paid program, but you can download the free trial, which also works, which is the one I'm currently using. The only problem is that every time you use it, it'll ask you to pay for it. Now, once downloaded and installed, go ahead and run Paragon Hard Disk Manager 14. Here, click on Migrate OS. You should read the uh, welcome screen here. All it says is that the designation drive will be deleted and replaced with the operating system go ahead and click on next it will automatically detect the source uh, hard drive which is a uh, Windows 8 NTFS 160 gig with 14 gigs being used it'll migrate that to my uh, SSD drive which is 64 gig and 24 percent is gonna be used now because the source disk is bigger than the destination disk or the target disk you don't need to check mark use all available space for the partition with OS you can leave it blank now go ahead and click copy now the copy process takes a while depending on how big is your used space on that drive I'm gonna fast forward this process once finished you need to read this carefully if you're planning on using both disk, make sure that you go into the BIOS and select the target location or the destination disk to be the first boot device. In my case, I'm going to remove the uh, source disk and just keep my SSD drive. But keep in mind, if you're planning on keeping both, change the boot sequence in the BIOS. I'm going to go ahead and close here and turn off my PC remove the uh, original drive C and keep my SSD drive I'll be back in a second okay I'm back I'm gonna go here to disk management again so you would see so I'll right click this PC manage disk management and here notice that I'm using my 64 gig SSD drive and again just so you won't feel cheated I'll right click properties here is my because it optimized it for my SSD it's less used space and I'm here using my SSD 64 gig thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel if you have any questions feel free to post them in the comment section below thank you